John Grant Jr. scored 10 goals against the Lizards. 10. 10. 10. 10. That's crazy. Let's play every goal in a row. Go. Over 40 years old. This is insanity. Hashtag Sports Center Top 10. Get it to Junior. You're watching one of the greatest ever to play the game. Major League Lacrosse history. Thank you, John Grant Jr. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. In the MLL now, the playoffs are set. It's the Machine versus the Charlotte Hounds and the Zards versus the Outlaws. I just can't believe the Bayhawks didn't make it. Shout out to those guys though for a killer season. We were talking about this earlier today, but I feel like we didn't give the Machine enough credit this year. They have one of the most unbelievable rosters I've ever seen. Watching the John Grant Jr. highlights and seeing that like Steel Stanwick was feeding him, Marcus Mark Holman was cutting around the crease, Kyle Harrison, I mean, your bomb, yeah. Schreiber. But I've actually kind of been saying it all season. The machine are turning on. The things now. that you think you've been saying all season? I've been saying it. I yeah. predicted it. You haven't been saying it here. Also, in one of the most interesting matchups this week, Instagram took on Snapchat by launching stories. Whoa! I kind of like Instagram stories. Yeah. I miss that I can't make myself look like a dog. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Well, you still can. You just open Snapchat. Yeah. I, yeah. You know what I mean, though. Instagram stories or Snapchat stories? Let us know. We put a poll up in the corner. Let us know. Vote. Instagram or Snapchat. It's like a light beam coming down right in the middle of my face. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Weird. Shout out to Team England for winning the European Championships in Hungary. Israel got the silver, so shout out to them too. But really awesome to see everything that went on in Europe over the past two weeks. And one of our favorite videos to come out, check out this. This is the Danish men's lacrosse team just getting so hype. I think I would freak out if that guy was yelling in my face. I don't know what they're saying, but I like it. It's so cool that those guys posted that video and they hashtag TLN Nation. We don't know any of those guys. They're all over in Denmark. It's just so crazy to me that you can connect like that today in this world. So that brings us to our next point. Whoa, that was crazy. That was weird looking. Play Lax Day is August 15th. We are getting tons of video submissions from all over the world. Here's one of our favorites right in front of the Capitol building in Washington, D.C. That's one of our favorites because it showcases the city. Send us your video to info at thelacrossenetwork.com before August 13th because I need enough time to edit the video and then put it out on the 15th. Also. What? Also. What? Also. What? Also. Yes, what? <laughs> make sure to make plans to get outside and play lacrosse next Monday, August 15th. Mark your calendars. Just get out. Play lacrosse, play lax day, wish your friends, wish your teammates, best day of the year. This week, did a tree just fall on my head? A tree just fall on your head. And by that I meant it was a leaf. There was but a leaf. It's frightening. Do you guys see that? This week. I said tree, but I really thought it was like a spider or something. <laughs> On with the show. This week for the High School Recruit Spotlight, we are going to showcase game time footage on Instagram because they have tons of recruits. Like this. And like this. Look at the flick of the wrist. Isn't that, how does, how does that song go? I don't know. Whatever it is, you guys know what I'm talking about. Oh man. Oh. I have a lot to say right now, so we decided to sit down. I want to take a selfie right and now. And Colin's taking a selfie. You'll be in it though. That was my selfie face. So I wanted to start this segment by talking about the lacrosse community. The first thing I'm going to say is that today is my birthday. Hey, happy birthday. Thanks, man. Appreciate that. Yeah. The next thing I wanted to say was some of the first people to text me and call me today were from the lacrosse community. I got an early call from Paul. I got a text from Kyle, Rob Pinnell, just amazing guys in the community. And I thought that was really special. For me, birthdays are a day of reflection. And looking back on the past few years, the lacrosse community has really been my family. When I started playing lacrosse 13 years ago, something I really loved was the team and the aspect of community. You could walk down the street with a lacrosse stick, see someone else with a lacrosse stick, and have a connection. This past week, I think we saw a really strong sense of community. The Shootout for Soldiers RV blew up, just exploded in flames on their way from Utah to Los Angeles. They lost everything. Cameras, computers, clothing, just everything. They put up a site to accept donations. Their goal was $5,000. They ended up raising $40,000 
in 24 hours. It was just amazing to see the whole lacrosse community rally behind their cause. The next thing I wanted to do is give a shout out to someone who reached out to me. His name is Ben and he started a charity for his best friend who lost his life. His name is Kobe and the charity is called Kobe's Cause. You can follow them on Instagram right here and click the link in our description to learn more about Kobe's story and Ben's initiative to spread his story and lacrosse around the world. Shout out to Ben and thanks for reaching out. It's so hot. Oh. Q. And A. Here we go. Questions from the TLN app. From Tnoll543, what is your favorite song? Like ever or? Hall and Oates, You Make My Dreams. I Want You Back, Jackson 5. Ooh, that one's good too. From Zara Flax, happy birthday, Samir. I hope you have a great day. Thank you. Laxboro3, sugar or chocolate chip cookie? Chocolate chip cookie. Mm, I like sugar cookies. From Reed, what is your favorite Olympic sport? Skateboarding and surfing are now Olympic sports. That's pretty cool. This is pretty crazy. Olympic basketball. I also like diving. I also get really hooked into the gymnastics storylines. Why is that? I don't know why. I think it's just incredible. If you had the choice, would you rather learn a new language or learn a new instrument? I'm gonna say learn an instrument just because I already know some other languages a little bit and I don't know how to play any type of instrument. Hit us with some Italian. Ci sono delle cose a cui io non posso dire niente. This guy. Who will win the Drake versus Eminem beef? That's not real. That's, That's not real beef? That beef's not real, no. That was made up by someone on Hot 97 who just started a rumor. Wow. And, yeah. That's yeah. messed up. But now Drake called them out at a concert in Brooklyn. Wow. So it's Called like, out Eminem or called no, out Hot 97? 97. Wow. Wow. You heard it here first. <laughs> breaking news from the source. That's it for the weekly watch. Make sure to vote up here on the poll whether you like Instagram stories or Snapchat stories. And send us your videos for Playlax Day. It's August 15th, it's coming up, and we need your videos by August 13th. You could also send your videos of you singing happy birthday to Samir. And if you know happy birthday in a different language, sing it in a different language. A lot of requests from this guy over here on his birthday. You know, you think it's birthday. your birthday and you get whatever you want. That's how it works, Colin. All right. All right, that's it. See you guys. Happy birthday okay. to you. Ooh. Happy birth. Well, it seems like you didn't like my voice. So. Mm. Yeah. <laughs>